vehicles will be used by the Navy's littoral response groups, bespoke, highly mobile amphibious task groups designed to react to crises in regions strategically important to the UK. The FATVs will be in service until 2058, replacing the BV-206 tract and older BVS-10 Viking models. Which has models. additional modifications to improve its performance systems in the water specifically for amphibious operations, where it has to swim snow, from ships ice, offshore to the rock, beach, sand, mud or swamps, as well as steep mountain environments. The new BMMP would use a common track chassis, which would offer good mobility on land combined with water jets, to, to, propel water water jets, to, jets, to propel the streamlined vehicle at high speeds in the water. Capable of when it enters the water, the crew would extend the retractable Boat plane in the front the and deploy a plate at the rear to improve vehicle handling. Will include variants it only of takes 40 seconds to extend the or retract these medical components. evacuation, recovery, and command and control. Ural Defense Procurement says Minister the DMMP Alex would be able to reach speeds of faster than 45 miles per hour on land and, and over 20 miles per hour on the water. Once ashore, the it world will be able to carry 10 troops up to almost 100 miles. The vehicles will be able to operate in almost any weather, including Arctic conditions of temperature. Below negative 50 degrees Fahrenheit. The signing of the CAF contract is great news for UK defense and for commando forces. The Russia design this would is be slower at sea, but the ZDB-2000 is faster ashore. In operating in More the important, cold weather it would be nearly littoral, four times faster the than the BTR-80s and minus 82s and BMP-3FS on the water with a comfortable a top speed snow, after has hitting the beach. amphibious swimming capability and protects its occupants from several threats. The concept the art shows is designed with five and six wheels on each side. to high north and to work alongside NATO and but this could indicate plans to use at least some of the chassis components from the in-production BM.